Hello Collective and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So everybody I am here to just I want to check the current energy see what's going on around you um, with this energy that we've got going on. I get the feeling that people are starting to flip out. <laughs> I know because uh, you know what I feel like the collective is just getting stronger and stronger by the day, by the minute. And um, yeah, people don't know what to do. Anyway, collective, this reading, um, it may not be for all of you. Uh, so just take what resonates, leave the rest, okay? Don't try to force it. And thank you so much, everybody, for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything that you guys do. Um, thank you, for all of my um, subscribers, everybody new here. Here. Thank you so much, you guys. I love you all. All right, Divine, what do you have for the collective? Yeah, man, see, I feel like... I feel like you've got this new beginning here. See, you're out in the public eye, or you're... Um, maybe you're... It's almost kind of like you're you're adopting a new strong energy here. I, I was just saying, the collective is just so strong. And I feel like some of you are telling your story, putting your experiences out there to help other people, right? Um, you know, I know when I started, it's not just when I started this channel. I say it a lot, actually. I'm out here helping people heal from a broken heart. And I feel like that's what you're doing. You're a light worker, an empath. Um, your experiences and your voice and um, the things that you have to teach others it's so valuable right now. I feel like you are out here mending broken hearts, you know, um, putting your story out there. But yet, at the same time, you're this enigma. You're, you're a mystery, okay? Um, that's just too many. That was my bad. Sorry. Um, yeah, you're, you're a mystery. You're keeping your moves hidden. And people may not know how it is that you're doing what you do. <laughs> I feel like, you know, whenever I see the star, I always think of this is your job. I don't know why I think about that that way. I, I feel like because you're an empath, a healer, a light worker, you know, this is what you do for the divine. And you're, you're, there's something about your energy and your abilities, your skills, um, I feel that are just such a big mystery. People don't know how you're doing what you're doing. You could be like having a glow up right now, okay? Um, and everybody seems to be loving whatever you're doing here. It, it could be anything, okay? And it's just that beautiful energy that you put into things. People don't seem to understand that um, light workers are very, very rare. And, and because we're so rare, people don't understand the abilities that we have, where we get them, how we use them, that kind of thing. I mean, you're an enigma, you know? There's a, this King of Pentacles here, they want to talk to you. This is somebody that has backstabbed you, betrayed you in the past. Um, I feel like they want answers. This could even be... No, I get the sense that these two are kind of working together. Why do I get the sense that they're working with somebody else? To try to figure out how it is that you're doing what you do. They don't like it. I feel like these people, um, whoever, I feel like it's multiple people here, a couple. Maybe these two are married. Um, it could be this Queen of Swords energy, this King of Pentacles that are married. They're watching you. They're both watching you, studying you, okay, stalking you. I feel like whatever you're putting in the public eye, and it's because you're a divine feminine, a light worker, an empath, somebody very intuitive, that's how you're doing what you're doing. Whatever it is that you're, you're on a glow up to, whatever it is that you're doing, it's leading you um, into a whole new lifestyle. This is you on a, on a total glow up here and about to step into something, a, a, a way of life that's very abundant, filled with opportunities, a lot of money here. Look at your, look, you could even be heading towards a fortune. Seriously, heading towards a fortune and a victory. Look, you are going to be or are already the most financially stable queen in the deck. 
I feel like you're going to be very abundant here. And I feel like, yeah, the victory, you're having a victory and you're about to get someone new as well. There are people wondering how you're doing this. It's almost as if you've manifested, you, you were able to energetically like open a portal, right? This is what they're thinking. Um, your skills, it's almost like you opened up this portal and you're stepping through it into like, I mean, this could even be like sudden wealth here. A major victory for yourself. Whatever you're doing, you've accomplished so much. And these people are just like, how are they doing it? You know, um, yeah, a lot of abundance, a lot of money is coming your way. I feel like you guys are about to be wealthy. Somebody here is about to be wealthy. You know, and I feel like this is just a big change too. A huge change maybe than what you're normally used to, you know. I feel like you've really had to work hard for, um, for all that you're about to receive here. This is a blessing, big, a big, big blessing. Some of you could be moving away, a house change, that kind of thing. But yeah, you've got people watching you. They can't take their eyes off of you. Whatever you're doing, it's fascinating, amazing, astounding. Man, I'm telling you, I feel like um, I feel like there's a, a couple working together here, possibly wanting to sabotage everything that you have coming towards you. A masculine energy who may want you back as well. But why they're still, you know, it's almost like they're uh, collaborating with others. Or maybe they just want to try to find out how you do what you do. I, I feel like that's what they're wanting to do, is find out how you're doing this. Because you did this all on your own here, with the help of the divine. Yeah, this could be, look, I, there's a lot of fighting going on in the background here with whoever they're with. They're fighting over this. They are, man, they're fighting over this. This is somebody who um, chose to give to someone else instead of you. You could be dealing with the Taurus and Aries. Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. They could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, maybe. You could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I've got Cancer. I've got Gemini. A little bit of Pisces, Aquarius. You could be any sign, though. I mean, it's really just energy. But yeah, there, there's, there's a, a couple who are fighting, bickering. I feel like they've tried to um, figure out how it is that you're doing what you're doing. They can't because these are special abilities given to you by God. Okay? They've got abilities of their own. You know, they need to focus on themselves. But yeah, I feel like um, this could be somebody who, this could be a father figure. It could even be like a, you know, somebody who's like a boss figure, right? An authority figure, something like that. But I feel like they're a couple together and all they're doing is fighting. They're fighting, fighting, fighting about you, what you're doing, uh, how you're doing it. They're jealous. I mean, I, people are going off. A lot of fighting with this person wherever who with whoever they're with in the background okay yeah this Emperor feels like a fool but the thing is is this Emperor is still very much in their um, in their ego okay and um, the, the Emperor doesn't like to look like a fool they don't ever want to admit that they're wrong okay um, but yeah I feel like they're being brought down to size a little bit. Well, wow, that was a lot. Wanting to keep you stuck. Thank you, Divine. Wanting to take you to calmer waters, but here's the thing. They're still with somebody else. Even though it's, a, it's like a battlefield wherever they are, they haven't broken away from someone else yet. If this person comes towards you, 
um, and says, get in, get in my boat with me, collective. Let me regain control over this situation. They're going to be face planted in all of these burdens and stuck in this situation all over again. I feel like you guys have freed yourselves. You've learned the lessons from the last cycle here. You've passed all your tests and you're, you're able now to graduate and move forward from the last cycle into a beautiful new one. You know, and I feel like this person just wants to keep you stuck. You know, that's where they want to keep you, but you're freeing yourself from this. It's causing a, a huge, it's almost like a war zone where this person is. All they do is fight about you. What's this? Yeah, death. I kind of get the feeling like they want to keep you stuck and they want to stop you from succeeding in whatever it is that you're doing. And I don't think they can stop you, especially if you're a light worker. If you're a light worker, you're doing a job. I usually see the star card as a job. I don't, maybe I'm the only one who sees it like that. But a light worker's job is a 24 hour a day thing. And you do it to help other people. So they can't really stop you, but they certainly want to. They want to. This person wants to take full control of the situation because they don't like feeling or looking like a fool. And they want to keep you stuck and end what you've got going on over here. Okay, this person is about to reach out. You're going to end what, what's on the bottom of the deck again. I'm telling you, they're going to be like, hey, can we talk? Yeah, you know why? Because they want to get you stuck in a mental mind trap. Doesn't that look like a mental mind trap to you? While they have control over the boat. Okay, so this person is about to reach out, but listen, they have been collaborating with other people to work against you and try to figure out what it is that you're doing or maybe even come up with a plan to sabotage you. Okay, they really just want to end your success is really what they want to do by getting you stuck and all up in your head. Okay, this is a big warning, you guys. Yeah, they want you to go from this, from the Queen of Pentacles, the Ace of Pentacles, having all this victory, to the Five of Pentacles, which is having nothing but struggles. So please stay strong. Stand your ground with this person if this resonates with you. Okay, this is not going to be for all of you, right? So use your discernment, okay, with any reading. But yeah, that's what I'm seeing here. I'm, I'm going to post this as a big warning, guys, for real. Stand your ground, collective. You have so much here that you earned that you need to protect. And I really feel like this person is working with somebody else, trying to, trying to stage some kind of sabotage some kind of deceit, some way to bring you down and knock you off of your game. Okay, that is what I'm seeing. There's a lot of fighting going on behind the scenes, a lot of static, um, a lot of chaos. And right now, so far, you have not been affected because you've been following your path and your calling. You know, but this person, they're, you're about to hear from them. And they don't want what's good for you okay not this person anyway not the one I'm reading for here they're gonna come in with an apology but look what's in that cup there's a fish in that cup and they know it they know it this person's coming in as a very upset emperor who has been shown that they made a foolish decision okay the emperor hates feeling like a fool so I feel like they want to bring you down, collective. They want to get you stuck, okay? So be careful with this person when they come around, all right? Yeah, defend yourself on the bottom of the deck. Maybe even just, 
especially with this one. Like I said, though, it's not for all of you, okay? You could be a Leo. I've got a lot of signs out here, guys. Cancer, Aquarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Gemini, Pisces. You know, you could be any one of those signs. So, yeah, anyway, collective, um, be very careful um, making a decision and, you know, getting in this boat, okay? Because that's what it's going to look like. It's going to look like this and, you know, they want to bring you down to the Five of Pentacles, guys. Anyway, I love you, collective. Um, I hope this helps. I really do. If you guys like this video, please um, hit the like button, like, subscribe. Um, if you like this vibe, and until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.